Under President Xi, the ruling Chinese Communist Party has become more repressive at home and more aggressive abroad. China is the only country with both the intent to reshape the international order and increasingly the economic, diplomatic, military, and technological power to do it. Beijing's vision would move us away from the universal values that have sustained so much of the world's progress over the past 75 years. We stand ready to increase our direct communication with Beijing across a full range of issues. And we hope that that can happen. But we cannot rely on Beijing to change its trajectory. So we will shape the strategic environment around Beijing to advance our vision for an open, inclusive international system. We are not looking for conflict or a new Cold War. To the contrary, we're determined to avoid both. We don't seek to block China from its role as a major power, nor to stop China, or any other country for that matter, from growing their economy or advancing the interests of their people. But we will defend and strengthen the international law, agreements, principles, and institutions that maintain peace and security, protect the rights of individuals and sovereign nations, and make it possible for all countries, including the United States and China, to coexist and cooperate. On Taiwan, our approach has been consistent across decades and administrations. As the President has said, our policy has not changed. The United States remains committed to our one China policy, and Beijing has engaged in increasingly provocative rhetoric and activity, like flying PLA aircraft near Taiwan on an almost daily basis. These words and actions are deeply destabilizing. They risk miscalculation and threaten the peace and stability of the Taiwan Strait.